A show of support for a Philadelphia police officer who was shot. Police said two highway patrol officers were shot over the weekend while investigating a shooting in the Northeast. One was already released and the other just got out of Jefferson Tor Torresdale Hospital just a short time ago. And that's where CBS News Philadelphia reporter Liz Crawford is right now. Well, Liz, it's remarkable this officer is okay. We're just glad to see that he's going home. Yeah, well, Natasha, this police officer was shot in the ankle and grazed in the head. Now, Philadelphia police are not putting his name out there, but we know he's 31 years old, a six year veteran, and believe it or not, this was the second time that he was shot while on the job. Now, a procession of support just came through here, but the wounded officer was released around four o'clock this afternoon. He was seen exiting the hospital in a wheelchair and was immediately greeted and surrounded by fellow officers who were here for moral support and encouragement. Now, again, a number of police cars and motorcycles exited the hospital, making for that procession here onto Knights Road. They had their lights on. Police did stop traffic for a short time as that procession came through. Many out here to support their fellow officer who will continue to heal from this violent ordeal at home. Now, yesterday, interim police commissioner John Stanford said while grateful the officers are going to recover physically, he noted the mental weight of being shot at in the head and face just doing your job. Just now, the president of the Fraternal Order of Police also emphasizing how grateful he is they are alive. Well, I can say by the grace of God that we have both our officers still alive. You know, um, it's just it's, it's just a miracle. And, and I'm saying that, that, you know, we're happy that they can go home to their families for the holiday. Um, more than likely, they will recover. Uh, physically, mentally, they should be okay, but we're going to be there with them 150% to make sure they get through this. Now, the two officers who were wounded, along with two others who responded over the weekend, are on administrative leave. That is typical. Police said the gunman was also shot at and is in the hospital. Liz Crawford, CBS News, Philadelphia.